Good evening everyone. So here is our first video from Sigan Mantras. I have already been writing a few posts on my blog page Sigan Mantras and uh, one of the posts is on pecs. So in this video I will be talking about how you can create those pecs, the customized ones at home. PEX is Picture Exchange Communication System. The cards that you see here, these are called PEX and they are used to help your child communicate to you what he wants, what he doesn't want, like that. So first to create the pegs, you need to have a list of all those things you want to put up on the cards. And that list would be very extensive. It would include almost everything right from waking up to washroom uh, activities, all the food items, the daily routine activities, various exercises, therapies, outdoor games indoor games, toys, and almost everything, <clears throat> expressions. So get your list ready. That should be in place, the first thing. Then you start collecting pictures. The pictures you can pick from clip arts. You can Google and pick some. You can click your own pictures with your own child, like your child eating, your child um, doing some art and craft work, your child sitting on the swing, at the therapy, at home, doing homework, like that. So once you have collected those pictures, you have to put those pictures on a Word page, on a Word document, like this. And along with the pictures, you put a text. So suppose, let me take one picture from here as a sample. So, dal chawal. So when you are making, uh, like creating a document and putting up all your images there, along with the image, the name has to be there and make sure that the text is bold, clear and in capital letters because along with the pegs, which is a visual um, cue to the child we are trying to give him the textual image also of the same thing this helps in developing sight reading <clears throat> when he keeps looking at the same pecs again and again every day so this way you have your cards sorry your images ready on one page now when you want to laminate <clears throat> there are two ways to do that So if you have a laminator at home, this is the kind of sheet that you get along with the laminators or you can purchase them separately also. So one way is inside the lamination sheet, you place your printed sheet <clears throat> and insert it in the laminator. Once it is done, you can cut your pecs. The other way and a better one is <clears throat> after placing your images on the word document you cut them into separate pictures and then place each one inside the lamination sheet. So like this. And then laminate. Why I said that this is a better way? Because it laminates each picture separately. When you cut it, each picture comes out as a separately individually laminated picture where the sheet of where this laminated sheet doesn't open up. <clears throat> so I'll show you here, like 
this is the one which when I prepared I cut the pictures first and then laminated so it doesn't really open up whereas the other one that I have here is with quite sharp edges <clears throat> which I cut after laminating it has very sharp edges and also it tends to open up when you use it uh, frequently every day it start the lamination sheet starts coming out so this is how you have to make your uh, like make a list then search for the images put them all on one page and start printing laminating cutting now your pegs are ready <clears throat> I would also like to show you a few pegs few of the lot that I prepared starting with so suppose you take your child to various places so you have a card handy for let's go to let's go to the play zone to the fountain <clears throat> to the garden mall temple go on a ride by car to the shop nearby <clears throat> so this is one category then you have all the food items dal chawal snacks fruits now in snacks also suppose if the child is fond of lace chips particularly the green one prefer putting the image of that particular chips the brand the flavor which he eats then dahi cucumber upma poha chila bread oats maggi sandwich idli <clears throat> then you have cards of snacks fruits drinks water banana chakli papaya cake watermelon alsi biscuit ice cream chocolate and you can also use these pegs in certain states like say suppose <clears throat> if you want to put the cake as a consequence say suppose if you do not do this particular thing you are not going to get cake so you can have this image of cake pasted and just cross it with the marker so no cake given this situation if this is not done then no cake for you <clears throat> so this way <clears throat> I also have cards for the routine activities exercise play alone time drawing book time cycling hang on the rod big ball talking time go back home if you've gone somewhere out dancing phone time writing time dress up puzzle time clean up time coloring wake up wear your shoes swing time questions time <clears throat> ladder time story time tv time reading school time medicines time time to pretend play skating eating time and then this is a card do this if you want to do any kind of imitation games imitation activities these are again cards of a few drinks then you can have most of the toys printed and make the cards <clears throat> then <clears throat> the cards of washroom activities for kids who are too small you can even have pegs for the rhymes that helps them uh, develop a good sight reading from the very initial stages once this is done you also print a few cards <clears throat> for no 
yes more finished done not now like that and have a few blank laminated sheets ready which you can <clears throat> anytime cut and make your card instantly when you really really need it and you do not have enough time to search for the image print laminate and then create your pack so these are a few examples <clears throat> which were made instantly and spontaneously with the marker when needed. Apart from these specs, there is an app called Let Me Talk. I would suggest you install that app in your systems. In my next video, I will be talking in details about how you can um, use specs extensively with the help of uh, that app Let Me Talk. That's all for, that's all on how to make pegs. If there is any feedback or anything else that you want me to come up with in my next video, please mention that in the comment section of this uh, video. Thank you very much.